Hello guys, welcome back. So guys, in this session, we are going to discuss how we can find information of any user social media account using uh, the Blackbird tool by using his uh, username. So before starting, if you are new on my channel, so like, share and subscribe and press the bell icon to get the notification of all my new videos. So before starting, if you have not seen my previous video about how to install Blackbird and what is the open source intelligence. So you can check out the video from the i button or you can personally visit my channel to watch that video. So let's get started. So first of all, we are going to uh, type here ls. So as you can see, here we have the blackbird.py file so we are going to type here black uh, python 3 blackbird.py and we're going to type here hyphen h for the help and it will open up the help so now here we have usage blackbird.py hyphen u for the username and uh, this is the double hyphen list hyphen sites this will show you all the list of the sites through which uh, this blackbird tool is going to gather information and if you want to set proxy you can pro uh, set proxy as well and uh, double hyphen web is for the gui interface and i will uh, show you how we can uh, create our osint search engine username so now we are going to use the command line interface so here we have an osint tool to search for accounts by username in social media networks so here we have options hyphen u for the username hyphen uh, this is for list and hyphen f for the file read results file and uh, uh, the proxy is to send request through uh, for example if you want to uh, create a link on uh, uh, your local host or you want to set a local port so uh, now we are going to simply search our user simply by uh, username so we are going to use here python3 and hyphen u for the username and our username name so you can use any username so for example i'm going to use my friend's username which is and press enter so it will search all the results for this username so as you can see uh, i have found the facebook account and the instagram account and uh, i think the ebay account also found and uh, search completed in 11.0 seconds result is also saved to uh, the username dot json and uh, if i click on this facebook link and i open this link so let's see it opens or not so as you can see uh, the link is open and uh, it is not showing us the complete uh, information about this user because i am not logged in in my facebook account so uh, let's check out the instagram account it is showing that the bio is computer expert and future developer and the followings are 58 followers are 53 and all the pictures are also available on this account you can download all the pictures of this account so uh, let's uh, open the instagram account open the link and let's see what is the information about this user is the information is true or not so viewers as you can see this uh, account is completely true i was uh, searching about this person and uh, here we have the computer expert and future developer it is uh, at uh, this the, this is the username and uh, these are the, some photos so i can't show these photos because uh, uh, i don't have permission to show you these all photos so just close this browser and uh, now let's uh, run this tool on our web how we can use a search engine username so we are going to use here python 3 and after that we are going to use the blackbird file blackbird.py and after that we are going to type here double hyphen and web to start our uh, osint search engine so enter so as you can see started web server on http uh, 127.0.0.1 and on port 9797 and uh, serving flask app web server lazy loading and debug mode off so now we are going to simply click on this link and open this link it will open the uh, graphical interface for us so as you can see now we have created our osint uh, search engine so now here we are going to again type that username so type here your username
now if you can see you have found the facebook account again and the instagram account so if i click on this uh, patch link and it will open up the facebook account again it is uh, not showing us the complete information because i'm not logged in into my account yet so if i click on this instagram account uh, to see this information so here we have the image no image and it is showing us the metadata of this uh, user so here we have again the 53 followers and 58 following bio is the computer expert and future developers uh, and uh, the user is double eight one zero so if i click on this uh, patch link so it will open up the instagram account of that user so as you can see this is opening in the same way as we have uh, seen in the command line interface so both are same but uh, it is in the graphical form and that is in the command line interface so as, uh, let's uh, now uh, control c to cancel it and let's search for different users so now we are going to use the command blackbird dot py and hyphen u for the username and now we are going to search uh, name tech chip net and enter so let's see how much information we can gather about techchip.net so as you can see facebook account found blogspot account found uh, and uh, proton mail account found instagram account found and the github account found if i click on the github and open the link so let's see what information it gives so as you can see this is the github account of techchip.net so you can check out all the information over here you can also check out uh, the Facebook of this user. So as you can see, this is the Facebook of this user and uh, blogs and uh, blogspot. Also, you can check out that. So you can open the link and as you can see, this is the blogspot of that user. And here we have the Instagram here uh, in Instagram. The name is tech chip bio is learn ethical hacking and cyber security following is zero here we have some pictures so i'm not going to show you that because i'm not allowed to do so so it was in our today's session we have seen that how we can gather information using the blackbird tool and this tool is very useful in gathering information in cyber investigation or in ethical hacking so that's it for our today's session and i hope you have learned something valuable from our today's session so if you have learned something valuable from our today's session so like share and subscribe and press the bell icon to get the notification of all my new videos so let's meet in the next session until then take care goodbye